Hi there, and welcome to today's Quentin Carpenter Nature of Flowers Photo P tutorial. Today I'm going to be using my mobile phone to do some photo editing. I'm going to do a colour splash with a rose, like I've done before using Photoshop, and it's going to end up looking like the image you see in front of you now. I'm going to talk you through it from step by step, from the very beginning to the very end in real time. Okay, and hopefully it won't go wrong. Okay, here we go. So, we're going to come out of my photos, we're going to go onto the internet. We are going to select Photo P, the online editing suite, into our web browser. It will come up looking like this on the screen. We need to have a picture to work from, so we're going to go to File, Open. We're going to go to Photo Library. I've already created an album for my Photo P tutorials. And there is the picture I'm going to be using to do the colour splash. I'm going to click Add. It will load into the screen here. Now, to do a colour splash, as I'm sure you're aware, we like to use two layers. And the best way to create a new layer is to go to Layer and Duplicate Layer. I'll see if that works. I'll go to my Layers menu here. There should be two layers, Background, Background, Copy. All good so far. We need to hide the Background Copy layer and click on the Background layer to make it black and white for the effect to work. So we click Layer again. We then go to Image, Adjustments, and we look for the black and white. Now we have to use our fingers to pinch the screen slightly so we can get to the OK button, and we click OK. You will see we have a black and white background. If I go to my layers, I've got a color version and a black and white version. I click the eye next to the color version, hide the layers menu again. Now one of the brilliant things about photo piece where I want to show you this video is a thing called Magic Select. So we click on Select, Magic Cut, sorry. We click on Magic Cut. We have to wait for a few moments for the magic to take place. But because there's strong color contrasts, it should, using its little computer brain, cut out the rows for us perfectly without us having to do anything. We click OK and boom! There is our color splash rose. Now that's fantastic. We're going to make sure we save it. So we go File and we're going to export it as a JPEG. We're going to click Save, and we're going to download it. And there is our amazing Colour Splash Rose in fairly quick, easy steps, using our mobile phone, nothing else, to do the recording. I hope you've enjoyed watching this um, Photo P tutorial on a mobile phone. It's the first one I've done on a phone, so I'd love to hear your comments in the section below. If you're enjoying what you're watching on Quentin Carpenter Nature of Flowers, be sure to hit that subscribe button, tick that bell so you get notified when I make new videos. Okay, thanks for watching, and enjoy doing some colour splash with your mobile phone. Okay, thank you, and goodbye.